Hey guys, what's up? It's Wainiac Babes here with another video. Today, we're going to be showing you how to push dash bend O's. Alright, quick little video. So, first things first, if you're struggling with the first video with blown O's, one problem you could be having is they always fall. One thing that could be contributing to that is your tongue placement. Your tongue placement, it should not be like in the middle of your mouth like it should not be in the middle of your mouth, like just floating there. Your tongue should be tucked. I tuck it underneath the lower lip. That's just how I do it. You can keep it on the bottom. You just, anyone on the bottom is fine. You just don't want to have it in the middle. That will affect the O and it'll go wherever it pleases. Another thing is a lot of beginners, what they like to do is they like to go like this and push an O or blow an O, like. You don't want to put your head down when you're trying to bend an O. What helps is tilting your head up. I know it seems like a simple thing to do, but it's really something you gotta remind yourself to do. You gotta remind yourself to tilt your head up just a little bit, just because usually it's just habit, because it's usually easier to blow an O when your head is down, but you just gotta practice with your head up. So, getting to pushing the O, you wanna keep your body behind the O. So, like this. Another thing is you want to catch the O really fast. Not really fast, but you want to catch it fairly quickly. You don't want to just let it float there and then and then catch it. The quicker you catch it, the better, the more stable it'll be. You want to make sure you're pushing it at the same time or at the same speed that it's going at. You don't want to push too hard or push too slowly because if you're too far back, it'll dissipate. And if it, you're pushing too hard, obviously it's just going to crumble. Keep hands spread open. Um, a habit I had when I first started pushing those was doing this, and that didn't really cover a lot of the O, so it would still crumble. You want to keep your hands spread out. Okay, that's pretty much it. So yeah, that's how you push an O. Um, once you get better at that, you can start doing other tricks and all that fancy stuff like jellyfish and lasso, you know, all that good stuff. So hope you guys enjoyed the short little video. I will be posting more about, you know, RDAs, mech mods, things like these, the little kits, uh, Stick V8, highly recommend, almost dropped it, but yeah, that's it for the video. Thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed, peace out.